to day eight of our 22 day band hit challenge. Um, I hope you're ready to go. You're going to grab your heavyweight band, 50 10 on your timer, get it on just above the knees. Okay, cool. We're going to be going into our high knees for our first movement. So we're going to anchor and we're going to use our lower core to be bringing our knees up. It's your lower core's job to do that. Focus on it. If you need to slow it down, if you want to hold on to the wall and focus on your lower core being the crunch, you can do that. If you want to do a mix, you can also do that. All good? Nice. I love high knees because they're cardio and their abs at the same time. We've got 15 seconds here. Push it. Chest is out. Abs are definitely on. Shoulders back. Knees up. Perfect. We've got 10 seconds to get into some mountain climbers. So, band is still where it is. Above the knee. We're going to anchor our palms into the floor, we're coming up, and now we're going to do mountain climbers. We're going to use our lower core again to crunch your knee into your chest. If your band bunches up, what I want you to do is try to hit your elbows instead, using your lower core to drive it, keeping those anchors in. Press firmly into the floor. Still got 20 seconds here. If you can get some speed in, go for it. If the band bunches up, take it slower. Take it out to the side. Five seconds. Let's go. Ooh, almost there. Well done. We're now going to come down onto the floor. Band still where it was just above the knee. If you need to rearrange it, do it. We're going to engage glutes and core. Bicycle crunches. I want you to point them toes as you go. Really use your lower core to bring that knee in. Use your upper core to get your elbows over. To that knee. We're almost there. If it bunches up, just have a minute. Take it back down. Engage. Point them toes. Kick the bum. Crunch the core. Almost there. Yes. Nice. Well done. We're moving into our second round of abs. So what I want you to do is hands on the floor, glutes on, anchor in. You're going to bring one crunch up and point it out. Crunch up, bum kick, crunch, bum kick, five, nice, six. I'm going to do mine in reps because I cannot see the timer right now. I've got nine, ten. I'm going to anchor my heel into the floor. I'm going to crunch. And then I'm going to point my toe, I'm going to kick my bum out, I'm going to crunch my core in. Five, six, good. Eight, nine, ten. Change it over. One, crunch up, kick the bum out. Three, nine, so okay. I'm going to do three more. Two, three, perfect. Then we've got one more to do here on the floor. We're going to anchor our heels into the floor. We're going to use our bum to push it out as much as you can. Three, two, one. Slowly resist it in. Re-anchor. Squeeze your bum. Push it out. Three, two, one. Resist. Push your heels, anchors into the floor. Engage your bum. Use your bum to push it out. Two, one, slowly close it in, push into the floor, use your bum to push your legs out, three, two, one, nice, push it in, push it out, three, two, one, slowly close it in, out, three, two, 
one it's your bum that is holding your bands out two one nice that's the end of round one so we're one round in two rounds to go two seconds let's do this back into our high knees it's your lower core's job to get your knees up we're going to get our chest out engage the core it's okay I'm halfway through this already 25 seconds left one two two whatever you need to tell yourself to get through it come on push engage 15 seconds yes you can come on engage lower core pick it up five seconds two one ten seconds into mountain climbers bands are going just above the knees anchor the palms ready let's go one one two two three three four four notice how my anchors are pushed firmly and evenly into the floor my lower core is in charge of bringing my knees to my elbows 20 seconds keep your back nice and flat try to engage your bum throughout the whole exercise through any exercise 10 seconds here let's go one two one two one two one two, one, two. nice mountain climbers done we're moving into those bicycle branches we're going to engage the glutes and the core we're going to point the toes crunch crunch nice point them toes kick it out crunch it in nice nice really feeling it in those obliques one two one two one two rearrange the band if it starts moving up put it back one two yes reach for it almost there well done perfect we're going to plug our anchors into the floor we're going to engage our glutes and core ready we're going to crunch in point the toe kick it two three four five six seven nine ten lower core in bum out two one i'm going to change over now one, I counted 15 reps there. Three, four, so I have to get an extra 15 of these in before that buzzer goes. Seven, lower core in, bum out. Ten, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Two, three, and we'll change. One two three well done okay we're going to engage our bum you're going to push your anchors into the floor it's now your bum's job to open keep it open three two one resist push the heels into the floor engage the bum tell your bum to open keep it open three two one slowly close the legs engage push the heels into the floor squeeze the bum it's your bum's job to push your legs open and hold it three two one in anchor again use your bum to push it out hold it three two one nice again anchor bum open hold it three two one almost there in open 
three, two, one. Nice little resist. Well done. End of round two. That means we have one round left here. I'm gonna get a very quick drink. And woo! High knees then. Ready? Let's go. One. Don't throw yourself through these movements. If you feel like you're really crunching your back into it, you're gonna take it a step slower. One, one, two, two. It really allows you to focus more on actually using that lower core to bring those legs up, which is what we wanna do. It's still gonna be really tough work. 15 seconds, let's go. It's our third and final round here. Push, 10 seconds. Well done. Five seconds, go. Three, two, one. Nice. Woo! We're going into then our mountain climbers. <laughs> Anchor. Ready? Up. Let's go. Push your anchors in. Engage the glutes and core. One, one, two, two. Use that lower core, it's not your legs job, two, two, one, two, I'm tapping my toes on the floor there, two, two, one, two, push the anchors in, we've got 20 seconds, we're not going to do this again, let's find that little bit of push hard, push the button, let's go, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two. Come on, three, two seconds. One, well done. Tough, but you made it. Okay, we'll rearrange that band. We're going in for our bicycle crunches. Ready, engage. Point the toes. One, two, yes, three, four. Get the core involved. Seven, eight, well done, come on then, you're not going to do these again, we're almost finished now, push that button, go, again, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, almost there, almost there, fight through, Come on, seconds left. Perfect. Engage the anchors, push them into the floor. Ready? You're going to use your lower core to crunch, point the toe, use your bum to kick. One, two, six. And don't forget, you'll either be going through rep count here or you'll be going through time. I just did 10, I'm going to change over, I'm going to go in for my next 10, point that toe, crunch, bum push out, 7, 8, 9, 10, I'm going to do it in fives here, 2, 3, 4, 5, again, 1, 2, 3, go core, cool. 4, Five, and we can take it into threes. Two, three, four, one, two, three. I know I missed the buzzer there, but I went in my lower core. We're going to push our anchors into the floor now. We're going to use our bum. Two, three, two, one. Resist to close. Push the anchors in. Use that bum. Open as wide as you can. Three, two, one. Resist, let it close. Again, push it. Three, two, one. Nice. If you need to, you can rearrange your band to move it higher up to your knees if it's rolling down. Three, two, one. Resist. Anchor. Glutes on. Push it open. Three, two, one. We're almost there, guys. Come on, push it in. Use the bum. Open. Three, two, one. 
almost there, anchor, use the bum, three, two, one, well, well done, nice work, day eight, finished, complete, well done guys, um, I hope you enjoyed that, that was a little bit of an ab special there, so you should definitely be feeling a lot of your core right now, um, Make sure you're checking out my stretch videos, um, they are useful, they definitely help. Um, thank you again for being with me through this journey and for choosing me to be your guide or to doing it with me, this is perfect. Um, as ever, please always let me know how you're getting on, I always love to read um, your little messages and it's quite inspiring for me, for me. Um, as much as it is for you for me to be doing these videos, the treat is actually for me because to have you guys here and following along is my inspiration and my motivation for getting it done. Um, so thank you very much.